Baganza from Portugal was the man who beat Cabrera in that European Games final. Really entertaining final that was. And Cabrera uh, looked a class act in his Baganza and he came in right at the very end. I remember commentating on that match and it was uh, it was a very high quality match. So uh, this is going to be interesting. The final bout of the day. Now, something we saw, we saw from Cabrera. We haven't seen Mamaev, of course, so it's very difficult to comment. But Cabrera, we saw, we just saw him score a point there. He, he can score. He scores in many ways. He's got lots of different ways of scoring. Absolutely, his front, his front leg is, is is his weapon. You know, he gets he gets in the distance with his front leg, stabs to the body. But and also, we all know that you can punch, as we can see, Mama as well. Yeah, he can vary from front leg to back leg. So, oh. you got Mama <laughs> going for a headshot there. Yeah, there's, uh, there's the both athletes looking to attack early on here. They were looking very sharp indeed. And obviously Boyd, ooh, takes a nasty one there. No injury, no injury time in Taekwondo. We're next to a Premier League football stadium. Maybe a few Premier League footballers should, <laughs> should watch this. <laughs> you take a, take a big hit and you carry on, no matter how painful. You are allowed the magic spray every so often if you're really hurt. Yeah, but if, if you are really hurt, then yeah, you, you probably probably gonna need it. And um, yeah, but uh, but I think now we're seeing the referee just telling you to get on with it and, and fight. Yeah. Yeah, he wants to see a little bit more action. There's no doubt we'll see some a little bit earlier on, later on. There's uh, you know first period. Oh, there you go. Get yeah. a spinning kick, you. He wasn't near his opponent, but oh, gets the point back as well. You know, Cabrera, he's, he's, he's so free, he's letting himself go, trying things out. Yeah, and, um, yeah, it's, it's, yeah, and, um, yeah it's really, it's, really it's, it's good to see that Cabrera's confidence level is just shooting higher off of the back of beating a world, the world champion uh, for the world number one. And Mamayev is, is not allowing him to play his game, so, yeah, so it's an even match between them two. It's certainly a, a very freestyle way of Taekwondo for me to. You saw in the previous results, they've both scored heavily. They've both got the armory. And uh, there's no doubt we're going to see many more points scored here between these two. I'm not sure what this His coach doesn't seem to say too much to Kabir. Some of the highlights from that first period. And of course, Mamia, well, he's got a little bit... Uh, of energy, extra energy, you could say, in his body, having not had to compete in the semi-final, having a walkover. over got Mamia again, a warning from, for holding. The referee's not going to allow that. Yeah, straight in there, wasn't he? Yep. So Cabrera is trying to invite Mamiyev in. He's, he does like scoring on the counter-attacks, but as you see there, very happy to attack himself. He really does... Uh, you know, he's not a one-trick pony Taekwondo athlete. Sometimes you do see athletes who, who have one particular style. Yeah and stick to it and they really don't want to change their game yeah Cabrera looks as if he's he's got everything yeah he does he he's just so confident about himself and and here mommy have just taken advantage of, of that back leg and it really is about who's going to actually cancel each other with the front leg and take an opportunity with the back leg but we know Cabrera is good in a short distance he can have a punch he can come with a back leg and both are really tall and really flickery as well to the headshots yeah there you go punch gets in as we know that Cabrera is really good at that coming in and goes straight away in for the body and it made a big noise which always helps doesn't it when uh, you punch absolutely trying to convince the the, the, the referees that that you punch the score because we saw final yesterday with a the golden point punch which when we watched on the replay I don't know if you saw that 
Yeah, yeah he, you know, he missed his man by a mile. Absolutely. Well, you know, sometimes the crowd could actually score it for you, or maybe your shout could probably score it for you and convince yeah. the the judges to give it. So, so yeah, so yeah, so it does it does come to play as well. Yeah, it's uh, they have made uh, a lot of the things electronic, but the punch. I'm just not sure if they'll ever get there. <laughs> But certainly the, the system of weight taekwondo has changed over recent years is certainly for the better. I've taken away the human element in so many areas. And, uh, you know, as an athlete, we can just talk about this for a second. As an athlete, you know, you in the old days when there was the variance of people, that must have been really frustrating. I remember seeing some bouts and, you know, you could almost say it was total miscarriage of judge, ju you know, justice. Yeah. Sometimes you had officials who were holding the keypad and because the guy on the left scored, they gave it, they pressed left, but actually they pressed the wrong button because they should have pressed the other button. Yeah, yeah that's the mistake that can easily be made uh, from, 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 from the judges. And um, it's something surely a, a fighter can't control, do you know what I mean? Because yeah. he's, he's more focused on his opponent and he's trying to get his points and um, but I think I think if, it, if it's obvious then I think they'll probably debate and say hey listen it should have been him should be the other one getting a point but I think sometimes you can get that fight sometimes you can actually yeah. be unfair in that matter and it can cost you games and probably and course, cost you titles too absolutely and of course at the Olympic Games you will remember uh, you know in, the, in Beijing yeah when we had an overturned Sarah, Over Sarah Stevenson, yeah. Stevenson. Yeah. You, and, you know what she was the first person to come to bring that uh, video replay yeah. um, into game and um, and it's coming to effect today Okay, back to this. It's the third period. Two minutes left. Three points apiece in this men's minus 58 kilo category. And, oh, an identical punch. Perfect symmetry on that shot. And these two. It, it's a good bout, isn't it? This really could go either way. They seem to have the measure of each other. Absolutely. They both want to attack. They've both got responses to the uh, opponent. It's, it's uh, almost like they both has similar style and, yeah. you know, with a front leg and going off with a back leg. And um, both think Cabrera is trying to be clever here and yeah. he's trying to, trying, trying to come into the short distance and go for that punch or maybe for the back leg. I love that shot from a low down camera. You saw the coach with his arms make a maneuver to his, his athlete, and his athlete then actually just perfectly didn't score, yeah. but did what the coach did, told him to do, and uh, got a good kick, just, just not powerful enough. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Cabrera got himself into a bit of a mess there, and oh. that's down. This will be a kill goal, Cabrera. Yeah. So now, a Kyungo may make all the difference here as we get into the last 45 seconds. So they oh. both got Kyungo reach. There oh. you go. Good kick from Mamayev. Mamayev uh, gets the back leg to the body here. Cabrera. There you go, for Cabrera gets his point back. <laughs> How often? He's done that all the way through this final, hasn't he? Uh, Mamayev goes ahead, Cabrera, but within 10 seconds gets it back. back. Yeah, he just... Uh, it's almost like he's preying on the fact that he thinks his opponent relaxes for yeah, a second. For the punch. Yeah, he just he, he just he's so composed, isn't he? Even if he's behind point, he'll find a way to get his point back and yeah. Nice. Oh, Cabrera nearly scored there. That was just below the threshold. And oh. Mamayev comes in. Oh, there you go. Gets a Kyungo, 30 seconds on the clock. That probably could cost him the game, but Mamayev also has got a Kyungo, so he could bring it back. There you go. There you go, punch to the body. Doesn't get it this time. Very few seconds. Cabrera has to do something. There you go, the punch five. and gets the punch. Gets the punch. Whoa. Whoa. There you go, goes a sudden death. How dramatic was that? Cabrera looking defeat in the face. And look at him, he's a, he's, he's a young lad making his way in the sport. And he's having a little grin and a little laugh of his coaches. And I pulled that one out of the bag, didn't I? <laughs> Absolutely. He's, he's, not, he's not afraid to be behind. He's just take it, take it on his toes. It's like he's he's just competing in a little club tournament in his in his hometown. <laughs> Absolutely, it's, it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing what he's doing, you know, being behind point and just easily getting his point back. Ego, both going for Ooh, the punches. Bang! <laughs> Beautiful. That's going to make a title sequence somewhere. <laughs>
Well, what a, what a great competition. What a great final this has been. And, you know, we've seen so many different types of finals. Here's yet an, how many sudden deaths have we had? Oh, oh yeah. sorry, I shouldn't say sudden. It's golden points these days, isn't it? I mean, well, it was, it was, well, we call it sudden deaths, but yeah, golden point. But, um, here yeah, we go. We have so many, but. Who's your money on? Uh, I'm gonna go. Oh, I'll go back with I was going for Cabrera then. <laughs> I, was, I was going for Cabrera then, but <laughs> but then Mamiya just took it off of it. Kick, kick round the back. Cabrera came in with the attack. Mamiya stepped aside. Uh, yeah. Came in with a kick round the back. That was a beautiful move. It, it you was. know, he deserved to win the final with that move. He did. He did. He did. What a, what a, what a beautiful, what a beautiful fight and a beautiful day for for, for Cabrera and Mamiya. Yeah. And uh, we're, we're, we're close today, very much paid off. What a great final, and uh, these two, well, Cabrera, he doesn't look too disappointed, you know, you, you've just beaten Palo, you've just beaten the man who's dominated this weight category over the last few years, and, you, you know, okay, he doesn't have to go around his neck, but he's got a lot of points for Rio, yeah. and, uh, you know, the, he only came on the scene at European Games in Baku, Yeah, absolutely. Um, lost out there when he looked like he was going to win that particular bout, yeah. and, and uh, here he is in the final of this, and he's certainly a man 